we have the pickups. So basically how it works is that the string creates a vibration in the magnetic field and the pickups pick up those vibrations and sends a AC current to the amplifier or to the transducer which creates um, from mechanical energy to electric energy. And from there it sends it to the amplifier and from the amplifier um, to the speakers. And that was um, Les Paul's innovation and he kind of revolutionized the whole guitar industry because he kind of figured out that um, you know by amplifying the guitar strings that everyone can enjoy the, the music. Okay, so our equation is um, V equals F times W, which is V is velocity of the wave, F is frequency, and W is wavelength. Um, usually wavelength, well, not usually, but sometimes wavelength may be denoted as lambda. That, I don't know if you can see it, but it's like a um, symbol right there. So the wavelength is like from chop, chop or crest to crest. Frequency is how often it um, goes, and velocity is that frequency times wavelength. And um, so the difference between, well, there's two different types of pickups. There's a classic single pickup, like right here. Well, it's kind of like, you see this one, but half of it. Um, those are like the ones uh, used before, and they're um, not as efficient as humbuckers are because they are prone to pick up something called mains hum, which is like um, frequency generated from area like outlets and stuff like that and in the US it's 60 it picks up 60 hertz of uh, voltage which is induced by a transformer and uh, humbucker pickups are two coils these two things that are reversely wound to one another so when the main tongue enters because of the reverse winding it cancels out that uh, 60 hertz that the classic single pickups would have picked up and uh, in turn the, the sound that's uh, given off is uh, double through that. Sorry. Uh, how it works is a uh, primary steel strings. So basically, um, everyone kind of set apart about this whole guitar, and this is actually like the whole reason why that's why we came famous. And um, I don't know if. Um, the other part of the group watched the video, we got to the part, but uh, someone told us about when he was playing, like, oh, we can't hear it in the back, so that's why he kind of started to um, invent this. And he also used a multi-track system, and in his days, they only had um, enough room for eight tracks, and now we can put you know, thousands of tracks on one, um, you know, one, one disc or whatever, one, yeah. But, um, for him, it was a huge innovation, and yeah. So, any questions? No? Yes. Wait, so the single one creates an interference into the sound? It picks up and it, it picks up interferences. Like, um, if you're gonna like plug a, 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 a cord, a triple cord into an outlet, it generates some kind of um, frequency, AC frequency which is about, what is it, 120, I think, 120, I don't know, it's the, I don't know, 120 hertz, hertz, yeah, but then, it, yeah, but it picks up, yeah, it picks up some, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just the classic the single pickups, um, because of, it doesn't have the reverse winding that the double, the humbuckers have, it can't cancel out that um, uh, interference that it picks up, so, it, Kind of like static ish. Are there any other types of interference like that Um, sure there is. Like uh, with probably within the um, well, cavity of like the guitar where you solder and stuff. Like that's why we lined it with uh, the foil paint or whatever. And um, yeah, probably like radio waves. And Stuff that can enter into the wood and cause an interference. But, uh, yeah. Um, how come some guitars have three pickups? Oh, 
So yeah, as this one, what we have is we only have two, but some Fender guitars have three pickups, and yeah, I think that's the max. But um, basically, the switch that you have when you switch it up, and then it goes, I think, towards the. I I actually don't know, but um, when you it, it changes the the pickup of the humbuckers. So when you strum, like if you're gonna pick, like you can. Because when you pick, you kind of pick it closer to the neck of the guitar, then you can want you can like flip it down so it it catches or it picks up the frequency cleaner and better than if you had it in the back. So like Fenders, I know that yeah they have three, so you can strain from the neck all the way to the end of the string. So. Uh,